Hey guys, welcome back to another video. I'm Kawaii. And today we're going to be showing you Dingo, our bed and breakfast, and the sleeve head drive. We stayed at Milltown House, which was a bed and breakfast just across the estuary from Dingletown. Hello! Welcome to Dingo. Um, in this room, we'll be sharing it with our two cousins. And let me show you around. I haven't looked around myself. Is there a bathtub? Yes, there's a bathtub. Ow! This is the big bed. That's the sofa bed. There's a table with stuff. Um, there's a door. There's a one-way door. There's a armchair. Yeah, there's two armchairs. Um, bedside tables, covered, and the bathroom, which is much more spacious than the previous room. <laughs> which is <just> does. <laughs> The decor in this house is definitely very granny core. But the highlight for us were definitely these two giant Irish wolfhounds. Meet Seamus and Ogie. Next door, there was also a horse scratching its butt against a tree. <laughs> oh yeah, man, they're so cute. <laughs> Dingle Town is just a 15 minute walk away with lots of food and beverage options. And it's also the home of this ice cream place called Murphy's. Dingle Harbour used to be home to a lone dolphin called Funky. However, it appears that it has since passed away. The next part of this video is all about the Slee Head Drive, which is a ring road that goes around the Dingle Peninsula. First stop on our journey was a ferry portal. The older locals believe that this is where fairies would come and go into our world. But it's now a petting zoo too.
Tradition dictates that you have to walk around in circles and repeat, I believe in fairies, 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 believe in fairies. Believe in fairies. and the fairies will appear. In this following image, here, there's actually a fairy, but it's an emoji because you can't see it because you don't believe in fairies. Or do you? Oh, that really he, he rescued is like a, an orphan or something. Should we? Next stop were these ancient beehive huts. Built 4,000 years ago, it inspired the Jedi Temple in The Last Jedi, Star Wars. You pay an extra 50 euros, they'll give you lightsabers to play with. And I made a new friend, and it's freaking cute. Oh my gosh, oh my days, it's so cute. Ah! Every stop we made on this drive was just so beautiful and scenic. Apparently, some of these caves were also used in the filming of Star Wars. Thank <laughs> you.
It's also really cool because below the rainbow is white and then behind the rainbow. Oh, it's good. The rainbows are because I got to on the rainbow. They're looking for their attention, for the prayer to be answered, maybe. Yeah. I'm going to leave the book down. I'm going to look to see the The final stop on the Sleahead Drive is this Celtic well that you won't find anywhere on maps. Shaped like a horseshoe, it is said to answer all your prayers when you visit it. I don't think the shape has anything to do with it though. That's it for the Slee Hit Drive. Look out for another upcoming video on the Dingle Falconry experience. Thank you guys for watching it. I hope you enjoyed it. Please like and don't forget to subscribe. Click here to subscribe and click here to watch my channel. Bye bye.